are now following the uh, pigeon truck out to the launching site, which is seven hours from here. Mr. Liu generously gave us a box of baiju, extremely strong liquor to keep us warm tonight, and uh, pig's feet to help soak up the liquor. <laughs> oh, I thought we were just gonna eat it separately. I didn't think you were gonna break the foot in half. <laughs> All right. <laughs> How's yours, good? Yeah. I'm in a abandoned parking lot, 500 kilometers away from Beijing. The sun has just come up and in a couple minutes, a million dollars worth of racing pigeons are gonna shoot out of this van and wing their way back home. My understanding was we were gonna be in the middle of a meadow somewhere. I said, oh, we're gonna take them out to a field, which in uh, my mind is some sort of mal scene with mountains and the sun coming up, not like a uh, derelict industrial ground. Oh, and somebody's bird is right there. That one we got nailed on the way out and landed. They just pulled the bird's head out. That's a little rough. It's kind of the, they shoot horses, don't they, Mama? All right, let's uh, get back in our car and see if we can beat these pigeons home. Once their pigeons have been released, the race is completely out of the owner's hands. And it isn't just losing they have to worry about. Any number of fates can befall their birds on the way home. They can get attacked by hawks. They can be eaten by dogs. They can just get lost. Scientists aren't even sure how their homing mechanism works, whether it's by smell or sight or the detection of seismic waves. So there's no safeguarding against it simply crapping out. Or they can be captured by pigeon pirates, which we thought was an inside joke until we met this guy. He is a pigeon pirate.也是在这边玩嘛然后玩玩玩弄了之后下午过来看了嘛有一只鸽子上面挂着就就拿集市上卖嘛就那个当时我也不懂啊然后他们说茶有成绩嘛然后卖了一万然后他们就说这是比赛
Until sundown? Yeah. Uh-oh. What happens at sundown? They will find a place where the road is high. They will rest and rest. What day is it? When the sun is up, it will continue to fly. Then it will fly. I think it's a big deal. It's not a deal. It's a deal. So we just heard from Mr. Boquin that his champion bird got home fastest. So he gets the million dollars and uh, and it is now the uh, the first triple crown winner in pigeon racing. This雨哥子呢，就是昨昨天你们拍摄那个吉格场景那个，这个赢得这场比赛呢，应该说是非常偶然，也应该说呢有一定的必然性。就是他付出的辛苦呢，非常大。所以我觉得呢，有付出才有